you have the same trouble after using a map? It's almost impossible to get it folded up correctly, isn't it? That one has 30 different sections. Here's a little puzzle that involves a piece of paper or a piece of cardboard, but it could very well be a map. You start off with a sheet of paper or card and begin by folding it in halves. There we are. Then fold it in halves again. And then in halves once more. How many little sections do you think we'll have when we open that up? Have you worked it out? Let's see if you're correct. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, I'll number them in a very unusual way. I'll start with the first four, the four on the left, and number them going around clockwise. One, two, three, and then four. Then I'll come over to the other four and start with the bottom left one, call that five, and go anti-clockwise. Six, seven, eight. Now, I've numbered them carefully on another sheet of paper, but in exactly the same way. There we are, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You'll notice that I've put numbers along the top and numbers along the bottom and some numbers on the back as well. Because here's the problem. You have to see if you can work out a way to fold up that map so that one is next to two, which is next to three, and then comes four, five, six, seven, eight, all in the correct order. So that if you were a little worm crawling through the folded map, you would go first through page one, then page two, then page three, and so on. You think you can do it? Let's see. It would seem logical to fold the whole thing in halves, first of all. So we'll fold that arm up there. Now fold that back there. There's one, there's two. But if we fold it around that way, <laughs> one is on the front and two is on the back. The other six are in between. That's not going to work, is it? All right, what if we fold it in halves that way? Now fold it across this way. There's one, there's two. There's still two other pages in between. That won't work. Seems impossible, but it isn't. You can do it in four simple moves. Here's what you have to do. You fold the left-hand side under, the right-hand side over. Fold it up in the middle and then close it like a book. Believe it or not, you'll now find that, first of all, there's page one, then page two, page three, page four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now, all you have to do now is to see if you can remember how to set up that puzzle for your friends. Mm -hmm.